Hola, muy buenos días, muy buenas tardes, espero que estéis todos muy pero que muy bien, bienvenidos un día más a mi canal, seguimos con un capítulo más de Red Dead Redemption. Vale, ¿qué tenemos que hacer? ¿Salir de aquí, matar a alguien o qué? Vale, guardamos. Vale, 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 no va bien esto. Uf. Vale, buscamos pistas sobre la banda. ¿Qué pistas hay que buscar aquí? Vale, a ver, cogemos. Chicle. Nada por aquí, nada por allá. Vale, creo que se entra por aquí. Vale, pero no se puede. Ok. Vale, una carta. Dear Uncle Tacitus, I do so hope you enjoyed your Well, thank you, darling niece Caroline. I guess I'm coming to see you in the cake. A ver, un segundo, ¿hacia dónde tenemos que ir? Está lejos.
Arthur! Arthur's here! Oh, Arthur! Oh, your laugh! Just about. Come inside. Come on, it's raining. Hey, everybody, look who's here. How y'all doing? Hey, old man, wake up. Hey, Arthur, they got John. Good to see you. Yeah, he got arrested. He ain't hung yet? Not yet. They moved him to Sisica. He's been working on a chain gang. <sighs> Howdy. Okay. <laughs> How did you folks find each other? What happened? Can can somebody give me a cup of coffee or something? Boss, <laughs> Mrs. Adler, who saved us, Dutch? After the robbery in Saint Denis, she got us away from the camp before the Pinkertons turned up. Then Mrs. Adler and Mr. Smith drove away the degenerates of a living here. Mrs. Adler, we owe you. Yes. yes. <laughs> Thank you. It's been real hard, Dutch. We... We've been surviving, but only just. What we gonna do? Things have been tough. There ain't no doubt about that. Trust me. I am gonna get us out of here. This ain't over. Ain't none of you folks interested in our adventures? Guess we're more interested in escaping the hangmen on our tail? Cheerful nymph of the prairie, wasn't you, Abigail? Oh, sure. My fair heart jumps for joy when I set eyes on you, Micah. <laughs> we buried Hosea Dutch. Charles and I stole his body from the law one night and gave him a proper burial. It was real nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, here you is. Well, I asked everyone I could find, and eventually someone new said you fools were out here. Shit. Give me a drink or something. Get your own damn drink. In our absence, Mrs. Adler here has been looking after things. Now sit down. This is Agent Milton with the Pinkerton Detective Agency. Already? On behalf oh, of shit. Cornwall, Kerosene, and Tar, the United States government and the Commonwealth of West Elizabeth... Here we go. We are here to arrest you. Come out with your hands up. Give them to a count of five, then give them everything. Actually, let them have it. Ask to everyone you could find, did you, Bill? Thank you. 
Es lo suyo, ¿no? Es lo suyo de aquí. Es nuevo. Descartos la copta, son si quieren más. Perfecto. Vale. Pues nada, para que vean que no corto los audios, que dejo todo y así es lo más natural, ¿no? some time to regroup. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, start packing up. Javier, you and Bill, get out of here. Go scare off any scum still loitering about. We need a couple of days. Now, please, gentlemen. Sorry. What next, Dutch? We just need some time. I just, I, I need some time. Now, we can't go east, because then we'll be in the ocean, so we're gonna have to go north, I guess. I just need somebody to buy me some goddamn time, one of you. You'll figure it out, boss. You always do. What are you gonna do about John, Dutch? John? He's in jail. Well, we'll get him. Abigail, just not not yet. There's talk of hanging him. It's not gonna come to that. Dutch! Not now, Miss I. Not now. I'm begging you to. They're gonna hang him and break my... The boy's heart. Please, do something. We will. Okay, I'm gonna go figure out how we rescue this bastard. No. Yes, now. Give me a Doyle's Tavern a million avenue. Okay. My lord, what a goddamn mess. Everything. Not sure what happens next. The whole thing's been hard on all of us. Most of all, on Dutch, who seems half crazed by all we gone through. How you doing? Still breathing. Dutch, vale, todo sigue como lo habíamos dejado más o menos. Vamos a ver a Dutch. A ver un segundo, ¿por qué el otro se me quedó ahí? bien mm. 
Vale. Vale, y tenemos el dinero de vuelta. Vale, perfecto. Es lo que quería ver. Vamos a ir a arreglarnos un poquitito. Y luego vamos a ver al Dutch. Vale, quería afeitarme un poco, pero veo que no se puede, solo dormir. And I'm sitting here, and I am contemplating the great journey of the sun, and considering a famous chess move. Those oily enactors of a mediocre justice, the Pinkertons, and their benefactor, the depressing millionaire, Leviticus Cornwall, they want us, Arthur. They want us. And they are going to have us. Well, maybe they ain't the problem. Meaning? I don't know. It's just, well... I can't help but feel we would have been better running off someplace else. <laughs> but the, the game ain't over, Arthur. I mean, I ain't, I ain't played my my final move, but... I guess I'm more interested in saving lives than winning a chess. And maybe life ain't such a thing to cling on to so tightly. No doubt. What about the women? You sound like Hosea. I miss... Um, I asked you a question. What do you think? We can't stay here. That much is obvious. Where are we gonna run to? I mean, they chased us from the west. They chased us over the mountains. They ran us into the sea. Arthur, do you have my back? Always, Dutch. But there's more than your back to worry about. We need more money. We've been on the run for months now, and I've seen you killing folk in cold blood like you always told me not to. And I'm sorry, but I can't help but think that if we There is country in Roanoke Ridge past Butcher Creek, I believe we could hold. Okay. You and Charles, you could take folks up that way. Micah and I need to do some reconnaissance. I ain't got a final plan yet. Arthur, I ain't got it. I just need time. I need time and no traitors. Okay. Charles. Will you ride with me? Always. Where are we headed? Up past Butcher Creek. It's Murphy Brute Country. That's why I'm asking you to ride with me. I understand. You okay? What are we doing now? We're looking for a place to hold up. Even the law won't follow us up there too willingly. Yeah. I did some scouting up there while your boys were away. And? Mm. You'll see. <sighs> I know the way. Follow me. Okay, boy. We need to get this done fast. The Pinkertons will have reinforced in another day or two. Yeah. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Quite a ride up there. I saw some canoes near the bridge up river, which would take us right up to Butcher Creek. Might be quicker. What do you think? Yeah, a boat's probably a good idea. Okay, good. It's good to see you again, Charles. You too. Thanks. 
For what you did in San Denis. Real brave drawing them off us like that. I was worried you and Abigail had both got yourselves killed. I found a spot to lie low for a while, then managed to get a ride with a wagon of workers heading out to the fields. Abigail said she somehow managed to slip away when they grabbed his air. You did good getting the others out of there. Keeping everyone together? Everybody was pretty shaken up when I got back to Shady Bell. Uh, it was a tough few days. I couldn't have done it without Sadie. So how did you find that spot back there? I assume the skulls on sticks weren't in addition to yours. <laughs> Old Strauss knew about it. The locals are terrified of the place, so we figured that might buy us some time. And it did. Until one of you brought the law with you. And where did you end up again? Cuba? Well, not exactly. An island off of there, called Warma. Landed ourselves in a heap of trouble. Really? A tropical island? Isn't that just what Dutch wanted? Uh... I guess it didn't exactly live up to his ideals. Anyway, I ain't always sure Dutch knows what he wants anymore. Perhaps not, but he's always managed to figure things out in the past. I know. You're right. Just... It's been... Uh... Guess I just miss Hosea and his uh, wisdom, you know? Of course. There's the bridge. There should be some canoes down to the right here. Let's keep it cool. Well, I see one anyway. And that'll do. Come on. Your creek is a few miles upriver. So I spent some time up this way while you were gone. I ran into rains fall and eagle flies. The Indians? And I've been trying to help out a bit where I can at the reservation. Things are bad there. That's not a surprise. They seem to be in a lot of trouble and heading into more. Some men there spoke a lot about the Murphy gang that hides out in these caves. And we're gonna need to be careful. They're animals. Everyone is terrified of them. Great! Dutch didn't mention this. Well, hiding up here, it's not a crazy idea. This is a spot nobody comes near, even the law. Just be ready. It won't be pretty. So be it. <laughs> Your creek up ahead. Who are they? The locals. Well, they don't look too friendly. Wait till you meet the Murphys. All right, let's walk it from here.
evening. These Murphy Hills, stranger, might watch where you wander. It's a bit of a walk. You could grab those horses if you want. You probably won't miss them if we get them back by morning. Folks don't want to come around here. Ugh. Watch it. Ain't exactly a... See that up ahead? Slow down, keep it quiet. It could be some of them. I say we dismount here and follow them on foot. See where they're going. Follow me, stay quiet. Closer to him. Come on, up this way. Definitely Murphy's. I say deal with them from here. You take one, I'll take the other. Well, how about I do the skinning? Then who do the What are you waiting for? Good job. Stop and have a look from the top of this hill there. Stagecoach went missing. Jesus. They must be in the cave. All right. Let's get on with this. Okay. What you think? I'm gonna head into the cave or flush them out with dynamite. Dynamite be safer. Yeah. 
Let's be quiet and hope they don't come out. Let's get this over with. and then throw it into the cave. Light that stick and throw it in there. A ver, a ver, a ver, ¿qué pasa aquí? ¿Pero por qué, por qué, por qué? Vale, le han matado a este hombre. A este pobre hombre le han matado. Get this over with. Just calm down. <coughs> we ain't gonna hurt you. Go. Where are you from? Antisburg. What are we 
do with her? Take her there, and I'll go get the others. Sure. Miss, you okay to ride on my horse a little? I'll keep you safe. Annisburg, right? Yes. They... 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 Um... It's okay, miss. The others, they... They killed them. You're safe now. Just... Try to breathe. They're animals? <laughs> I know. Yeah! <laughs> It's all right, miss. Not so, so right. So you were saying before. Some folks is just evil. Ain't no point trying to explain it. I know. What's your name, miss? It's okay. <laughs> Meredith. You're gonna be home soon, Meredith. And this will all be over. Thank you. Where in Annisburg? One of the mining cottages. Um, <laughs> if you get me to the main street, I can show you from there. Okay. Just try to relax now. I'll take that, pal. <laughs> Main Street? It'll be easier to walk from there. Place is yours. Up at the top of the hill. It's near the blacksmith. Mona. Ma! Ma! Meredith! She's alive! Oh, she's alive! You saw some pretty bad things, I'm afraid, man. Murphy Brew guys. Oh my god. How did you manage well, to? I just ran into them and found her. Oh, thank you. Here, let me give you this. Oh, that that's okay, ma'am. You just Keep her warm and keep her safe. <sighs> this is death? Oh no. You leave me alone. You just leave me alone. Thanks, buddy. How you get on? Okay. Found a girl. Took her home. Oh. You and Micah find anything? Maybe. I think maybe. I found our old friend, Mr. Cornwall. You did? Yeah. He's buying a stake in the mine in Annisburg. Relentlessly ambitious fella, isn't he? Mike and I'll sniff about, see if he knows we're here, and exactly what his plans are. So, Dutch! Did you miss me? I found her drunk in Saint Denis. You're back. How jolly, Miss it's O'Shea. Funny, you suck of shit. Back Who and are you? drunk. The master, the Lord Money. God Almighty. Oh, Calm down. I won't be ignored, Dutch Vanderlyn. I am in him. I ain't her. I ain't your stooges. Calm yourself. You don't know me nothing, Miss. I don't know you nothing. 
Nothing. Okay. I spit in your eye. I did. I told them. I'm sorry. Yeah, I told them. I tell them again. Now I've got God's ear. You told who? What? Mr. Milton and Mr. Ross about the bank robbery, and I wanted them to kill you. You did what? I loved you, you goddamn bastard! Go and shoot She's me! Crazy. She ain't worth it. You told on <laughs> oh, me. You're you not betrayed so big now, me. Are you? Just calm down, Arthur. <laughs> She's a fool. Get her out of here. You know the rules. You're not so big now. Hurry, Your Majesty. You. Take her. <sighs> she knew the rules, Arthur. What the hell is wrong with you? Mr. Pearson, Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. Okay. Now get back to work, all of you! Quit your lollygagging! Right. Get back to work! Señores y señoras, vamos a dejar, nos vamos a afeitar, vamos a recortar un poco todo este vello facial, nos vamos a poner guapo y poquito más. Y poquito más. Hasta luego.